Welcome back to my kitchen. So on today's episode, I'll be making delicious, yummy, sumptuous nsala soup. White soup as widely called. This soup originated from Anambra state of Nigeria and is widely enjoyed in our nature, Anambra state, as well as the Otuacha, which is Aguleiri, Umuleiri, and Anam areas of Anambra state. So guys, stay tuned to find out all the ingredients we are going to use to make our what? Delicious, yummy nsala soup. So for our delicious yummy nsala soup, we're using all these ingredients and I'm going to leave the list at the description box. Okay. So this is the washed hen and I'll be using the pressure pot to cook it today. So this is washed. I'm gonna dump everything right into the pot. Nice. Now I'll be cooking this with one cup of water. Some salt for taste. And one shrimp seasoning cube. And I'll be adding one Scott Bonnet pepper. So I'm cooking for three for 30 minutes while I get ready and also prepare the other ingredients. Right, so I'm gonna blend my pepper. So I have two scotch bonnet pepper here with my okoro okay i'm going to blend the bush pepper which is ozeza seed my hen is cooked so i'm gonna get it right into the pot Eat the sala soup right now the hen is well cooked and looking so good okay i'm going to add the dry fish everything here is washed and clean really really roast there we're gonna cover the pot and bring to a boil Our soup is looking good. So right now I'm going to add some of the crayfish and the pepper we blended. We are going to add the ozuza seed, the bush pepper. And then give it a stir. Wow. This smells amazing. So at this point, I'm gonna be adding the Ozeza leaves because I'm cooking with dry Ozeza. That's why I'm adding it now. If not, you would have added it almost at the end of them. And also likewise, I'll be adding the fish. This is thoroughly washed and clean. Yeah, we're gonna get it into the pot. Guys, for our thickening, I'm going to be using this for thickening. This is potato flakes. Oh, I turned it upside down. Silly me. <laughs> so it's mashed potatoes. So that's what we have here. So I'm going to be using it to thicken my white soup. And you can see our white soup is looking delicious. Ready? So I'm going to cut a few to get the lumps in and that will be our thickening for the day if you like to use um uh, pounded yam yes you can do that if you like to use the archie you can also use archie i prefer to keep it on low carbohydrate level that's why i'm using potatoes the one they call a potato joss Irish potato for some people, just we call it potatoes here. So we're going to allow it to all cook together and it's going to be our thickening for the day. Let me get this one over here. Our pot is looking amazing and we're going to cover to cook. Uh, 
right so our soup is almost ready if you notice we haven't added salt because we seasoned the uh, the hen with some salt and so i'm adding shrimps uh, seasoning cube so i'm gonna stir gently because of our fish so it doesn't all scatter you can see the potato thickener is already dissolving nicely so right now i'm going to taste for salt if i still need to add some salt yes feel free to do but right now let me see and see what i got mm. all right the taste is right so i don't need to add salt in this pot of masala soup the seasoning cube i added is right enough so we are going to allow it to boil for another minute or two and then we are done for it's the day ready this soup is called white soup, I believe, because there is no um, oil to it. So it's already, I'm gonna get it into the plate. And we do thank you for watching our Indoki Kitchen and Lifestyle today. If you like this soup, give us some thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe if you haven't subscribed yet. We do appreciate you all. Thank you, thank you. And our soup is very delicious. The next thing will be for me to taste. So guys our food is ready i'm gonna dig in and i'll be eating this with potato flakes and first of all we'll bless our food okay all right so let me find some space to dig in mm. it's so delicious everything is just right on point Oh my gosh. Guys, try this. It's so delicious. I tell you. Thank you for watching the Ducky Kitchen and Lifestyle. If you haven't subscribed, don't forget to subscribe. Give us some thumbs up and leave us some nice comments. Till I see you next on my next video, stay well and be well.